This is Lou DiNapoli. Today I'd like to go over and uh, show you what the push buttons that are standard on the Psytrans P can do for you and, and the various modes that you would go through to configure a transmitter without the need for a hard handheld. Okay, let's say you want to set the transmitter up 0 to 48 inches is 4 to 20 milliamps. Simplest way to do that would be to come in to, since we want the transmitter to do it, uh, we want zero, and there's zero inches of water. And right now this transmitter reading 60, so I want 48. So what I would do is hold the down button, and it'll start scrolling down, and it'll increase speed. And I'll probably, oh, I didn't overshoot, so I'll scroll down again. And we're going to stop. Oh, I overshot, as typical. And now we're going to come back up to sneak up on 48. And there's 48 exactly. So 0 to 48 inches equals full scale. Let's say the customer threw us a curve and he says, you know, I really would like this to be in feet of water rather than in inches of water. We can do that very easily by going up to mode 14 and changing from inches of water, use the up button, there's inches of mercury, there's feet of water, and now simply enter that by hitting the mode key. And you'll note that the transmitter, zero feet of water equals 20 milliamps, uh, 10, excuse me, four milliamps, and now four feet of water. The transmitter did the math for you. So there it is set up zero to four feet equals four to 20 mils. Let's look at the buttons and how, what, what, what happens here. This is the mode button, and that's what's changing from one mode to the other. This is the up and the down button. So uh, in our example of zero to 48 inches, we take the transmitter, we come to mode four, five, five says zero to 100 inches, uh, zero inches, so we don't have to do anything. We come to mode six, mode six says 60 inches. I want 48, that's what the customer wanted. So I wanna hit the down button, and now I'll press the down button, and she'll start to integrate downward. She'll pick up speed, and you'll probably overshoot, because I generally have, there's 45, so now I gotta come up. I want 48. I'm going to hold this button down, and there's, whoops, 49, and this is typically what will happen, and there's 48 exactly. In order to lock that in, I hit the mode button, go from 6 to 7, and now that's locked in. In the other example I gave you, the customer wanted me to change that to feed of water. So how I would do that is, I would use my mode button once again to go from mode 7 to mode 14, and in mode 14 is where I pick the units of pressure that I want to measure in. So I'm going to scroll through. He wanted feet of water. There's inches of mercury. Up, ah, feet of water. I will lock in feet of water by simply hitting the mode button again, and now the display. Uh, now if I go to mode 5, it says zero feet of water. I go to mode 6, it says four feet of water. Four feet of water is that 48 inches of water that we had set in the display prior.